No more flower tortillas for you. You're you're beyond that now. I believe in you. Time to put cheese on your grocery list. If you don't have it already, let's get it going. Happy Taco Tuesday. It's the day we're all waiting for besides Friday. Generally the day that I wait for. But yeah, Taco Tuesday is cool too. You're just gonna have to roll with me today on this picture representation of the process you'll need to take to achieve crispy cheese tacos. Vlogging every day is a time management challenge. We're just gonna go right through this process with the use of pictures. I know you can do it. You're smart. You can do things. I can handle things. I'm smart. Not like everybody says. Like dumb. I'm smart and I want respect. Yeah, that's from Godfather. I believe in you. I know you can do it. Let's get this party started. First thing you're gonna need is a cast iron skillet, one of my favorite kitchen tools, a metal ring, and also your favorite grated cheese. I suggest using Parmesan. Let the cheese melt for about two to three minutes over medium low heat. Get your spatula. Take the ring off of the cheese carefully. It's gonna be really super hot. Take the disc of cheese and you're gonna place it on top of a wooden spoon handle. Yes, you can set up this rig that is pictured here. It's gonna create that little curve shape that we need for our taco shell. You're gonna let it cool there for about 10 to 15 minutes. Guess what? You have a crispy cheese taco shell. You're welcome. Now you can start filling that up with whatever you'd like. I'm a really big fan of guacamole. You can tell me what you enjoy in your taco. You leave me a comment down below. Also, don't forget to follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. Although, I will say that I am very partial to Instagram. Let's face it, it is way easier to navigate and way more fun. There, I said it. There it is. I will see you on the next episode. It's gonna be tomorrow. Yes.